everybody, welcome back to another episode of Infiltration. I'm recording this one back to back with the last episode, so any comments won't carry over, unfortunately, until I stop recording today at some point. Uh, but uh, we are still at Tiber, uh, and I did, rather than, I, I mean, the Piranha was like a, two days away from being finished repairing once we got everything else updated. So I just, I just repaired it just because I wanted to see what I had done with it the episode, or two episodes ago. Uh, so let's go to the bays real quick and have a look what I did with the Prona. I don't think I did too much with this thing. Um, oh yeah, we put the tag on it. ER medium, regular medium laser, uh, and a pirate me uh, ER medium. Just because that's all I had. And regular heat sinks. I took the double heat sink kit out. So the cooling really isn't that great. Um, but we'll worry about that later. Um, this is really if we need to alpha stuff. So, yeah. Um, we also got a machine gun in here as well. Um, but that's all I did with this guy. Max out the armor and stuff, so it's pretty good now. Actually, we can... Actually, I'm not going to add anything because it's going to cost us a day in uh, time here. But we got five mechs to run today. So, uh, when we jump systems, I'll have another look because we picked up, I think, some medium lasers that we could throw in here. So that'll be good. But uh, let's have a look at... The, oh, let's have a look at the mech wires first just to see what we got here experience-wise. Don't think we have too much. I want to go guts for the plus one health or unsteady threshold. We haven't really needed unsteady threshold on her, but I'm thinking piloting might still be the best way to go. Uh, let's go for survivability because I think she's pretty important right now. So let's confirm that. We don't want her to die on us. So Gondal's got nothing. Yeah, Goofy. Uh, do we wait for gunnery or do we go for piloting? Let's wait for gunnery. And you've almost got enough. All right, so we're good to go here. Um, let's have a look at our contracts today. Uh, turn the tables is a good possibility. Um, one well time strike against Wolf Manufacturing Plant here in Tiber Clan System. Um, yeah, let's do this one. We just did a mission for Clan Wolf. Let's do one against them now. Uh, but this is going to give us an opportunity for some good salvage, I think. Some good clan salvage. So let's go Max. And we're going to bring in uh, Gundal and the Piranha today, too. We're going to go with five, I think. 90,000. So we'll still be making a few sea bills here. As long as we don't take too much damage. Let's deploy and get this done. All right, here we go. Destroy several structures around the target facility, and we are a good distance away. Huh. Hope you know what we're doing, eh? Well, find out soon enough, I guess. You have orders? Yeah, we need to get up here, buddy. Um, so what do we got here? How do we get up there? Guess we're forced to go up this way, and well, that's a good distance away. Looks like we're coming up this way. That's fine. So we're going to be heading this this direction. Uh, yeah. Down, moving out. Move out. Excellent. So I left uh, Helion in the Firefly again this mi for this mission to see how it goes. It's the fastest way for you to get there. Well, let's just keep going this way. I was thinking maybe bringing her over to the wall and jumping her up and then having her move along, but I don't think it's going to be any faster. Come on, Dallas. Acknowledge. CW30 or C30W removed, eh? Good to go. Good to go. Holy shit. Look at the speed on this guy. Yeah, maybe we need to get the Beagle Active Probe on that guy. Hello. 
Yeah, I think we need to pull the ER large. Just gonna walk it up this time. We need to put it back on the uh, on the Firefly. If we're gonna, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna continue to play on the big maps. I might, I might uh, remove that from the options. Still haven't decided yet. Probably a good idea though. But if I'm gonna continue to do that, then the ER large has got to come off this mech, I think, and go on the Firefly. Maybe we do we do large slash ER large on the Firefly? Of course. Have it a long range fire support? I don't know. Don't know yet. Waiting for orders. Position confirmed. So this guy's just got mediums. Mediums and maxed armor. Defending ports, forces and wolf support lance. Wonder if they'll have five mechs. Awaiting orders. That would be interesting to see. All right, see if we can spot anybody yet. Most unlikely. Now, if these turrets don't have any LRMs or any any uh, indirect fire capability, I'm gonna try and pull the escort away from the buildings first, Full and then deal with them, and then go after the turrets. The turrets do have LRMs. Then we're on the LRM turrets first with our best ranged weapons. Will our close range weapon units take on the mechs? Until the long range turrets are gone. What's up, Commander? And then we will um, Move order received. get back on all the mechs again. I want mortars and grenade launchers and the LRM turrets until they're gone. Everybody else take on the other mechs. Yeah, having my best pilot, my best gunnery pilot at the back like that. Got to fix that. Got to fix that. I think I still think it was the right move to put her in the Firefly, just the sheer volume of weaponry. But it's the wrong weaponry. I got to fix that. I think more than anything. So we're probably going to pull the ER off of the uh, Piranha, ER medium that is. ER large um, off of the Mongoose, and put both of those on the Firefly. Because she's definitely going to have to engage from range, most likely to start on larger maps like this. Ready for order. And this guy will probably just go down to three me regular medium lasers. That should be more than enough heatsink wise to uh, be able to handle. Right now, the pirate and the ER, the clan ER medium, is definitely adding to the way, like the overheat on it. Like we can change this out we're going to save one ton if we put the clan er in pull these two out and put the clan er medium in we'll have three medium lasers and a couple of er's you know barring whatever we get from th from this mission here today i mean the other thing too is we can pull out one of the er mediums from this mech and move it over as well to balance it out or if we can get another clan lrm like L another clan lrm 15 we can pull the mediums out of this altogether and put him in the Firefly. We're definitely gonna have to be very, very careful of heat sinking though. Now, how close are we getting here? All right, they're gonna be seeing us soon. Um, so let's not round this corner. I'd be very mindful of that. Let's get up in here. About five bucks. So all I'm, so I'm asking. Five bucks. Okay, what do we got? Pegasus Scout Hover Tank. Yeah, thirty-five tons though, so I shouldn't be shrugging, shrugging it off. 
I think it's got SRMs on it. SRMs or LRMs? Two streak SRM sixes and a couple of ER smalls. Those SRM six streaks would be nice on this Kit Fox. Sure as hell would. Because mm -hmm. then we can give the Kit Fox back to um, Helion with a pair of SRM sixes and, a and maybe the ER large or something. Let's drop some missiles on this guy. Not going to be doing much damage, but uh, it's a start. So is that a turret post right there? One right there, one right there. One up here. And one up here. So there's three in the front and one at the back. So we got to be careful of direct fire too. They are clan too, so they're going to have range on them, so we've got to be very careful about those turrets for sure. Ah, that's another vehicle. Yeah, you guys just stay back there. Okay, here it comes. Hopefully we can get some direct line of sight on this and blow it up fast. We need those streaks gone. Be nice if in the uh, salvage they clustered as two so we can get two of them for one one selection. I've got Another Pegasus. Is that two Pegasus now? Two Pegasi? Oh! That was indirect fire. That was from the turret. Yeah, it's indirect, so it's, I don't know what the hell it is. We need eyes off. Everything on this guy, please. To start. Awaiting orders. Wow. Okay, one hit. Not bad. Yes, command. Hmm. So that's the left. Right. Okay, so let's go this way. It's gonna pull you back. How much damage in the leg do we take? Oh. They have indirect, it won't matter. Full throttle. Oh shit. That's a lot of defenders. We need to pull these guys back then. Alright, let's dump everything on this guy. All weapons committed. That was weak. Alright, this is going to be a long battle. Yeah. 
you cannot get any eyes on. None of those guys are moving forward. It's only a 10 ton ripper though. Still. These guys have got to go down. I wonder if it was the ripper that shot us before. If it has like the the uh, tag um, the tag um, arrow system, that could be it. I, I, although I, I'm pretty convinced it was that turret because the turret showed up on the map, right? Now the only question is, is do we try and pull the choppers down? before we back up or back up while we're shooting them you know this this type of map and gameplay like if you were fighting if you had if you had patience you could go in with a scout lance like you know like five 35 ton max or, or eight 35 ton max into a uh, five star um, mission attack the enemy and pull them back into your uh, um, defenders and while your defenders are engaging the enemy you could just gang up on them one at a time and pull them all down but you'd need to have really good uh, evasion Definitely good ECMs, good evasion, um, as much defenses as you can, like AMS, um, a lot of armor, whatever you could get to reduce damage, incoming damage. But it's 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 a doable, it's a doable thing. It would definitely make for a fun match, that's for sure. But that would be a, like a few hours of play or more, I would imagine. Like, could you imagine facing like two assault lances with 35 ton mechs and your escorts? Now, are these guys all rippers? Somebody's doing some calculations here. Wonder if it's that turret. Well, we're spread out enough now that it should only affect one of us. I think these were all rippers, weren't they? Badly damaged is this guy. Not very. get out of the direct line of sight of that that turret would be able to see us light ATM turret we don't want that guy shooting at us though um, fifty percent chance to hit though we can pull these rippers down But if I do this, then we're committed. Don't know how 
much armor these turrets have. Ah, hard decision here. If anything, we got to be in the trees, which we would be. Let's do it. Let's do this. Okay, so we got two rippers. Two energy and a ballistic. Let's take this guy. Wow. Really? No damage detected. Whoa. Okay. Yes, Commander. <sighs> We're in a bad spot here. They definitely have the uh, positioning on us, that's for sure. Oh, there's the guy I shot at. Confirm. Ooh. Roger. Oh, nice. One for the scrap heap. Okay, good start. Just for now. Okay, loses his instability. Stinger, okay. We do have ability to get out of here if we have to. Commander? Okay, only one thing for direct fire here. Let's move around. Our one vehicle can shoot at us. Wow. Uh, oh yeah. Maybe Helion can finish that vehicle up. Then we'll melt back a little bit, draw out the other vehicles. I think these are the guys with the arrow. That ballistic weapon, I think the two energy and the ballistic, I think that's the uh, tag arrow system. I think, I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, it seems that way. Trees are superior. I'm out of armor. Come on. Oh, you do have a chance to pen this guy. I'm listening. Mm -hmm, I'm going. Finally get into the battle. Let's do this. Oh, two pens, but not enough to kill. I'm guessing you didn't like that, did you? I don't think he did. We could definitely kill him next turn, though. If he sticks around, that is. Hey. I thought I did like 38 internal damage to this guy. I guess I just wasn't reading it correctly. Oh, I did. Okay. That was all side hits, really? Opposite side hits? All right, whatever. Alright. 
think that Pegasus has got a different uh, loadout. Oof, that was the turret. Jeez, you stay back there, buddy. Okay. Oh, that was the light ATM turret. Four hundred and sixteen armor, eh? Can I get you down? God, it's just not... I can't lose this leg. Um, just stay back here for now. We're going to be moving back shortly anyway. I mean, normally we just have a lance anyhow, so... The extra mech is really what it is. Yeah, see, they, they're going to have 10 defenders. What does this Falcon have? It's giving me his back, though. I wonder if we take it. We can move these two guys back. Use the missiles. I don't know if we can hit the back from back here, though. Hmm. I'm here. All right, let's do it. Nice. Vehicle down. Awaiting orders. I think we try and take the obvious kills. Let's pull some of these guys out of the battle if we can. Yeah, if we get some good side hits, drop everything on them. There we go. Nicely done. No matter what we do, we're going to be exposing ourselves to that vehicle. Do we know what he's got on him? Commander. We don't, but I want to free up... Uh, I want to free up Infiltrator to be able to do uh, some other stuff. So let's go after this Ripper. Four hundred and forty armor. It's a chance of penetrating this guy's backside. It's gonna make us unstable too.
Nope. Okay, stability back. Let's hopefully finish this guy up. Uh, how many rounds do we have left? 188 tons. See ya. Enemy unit destroyed. Okay, so that's three down, four down. Right now my biggest fear is the turrets. Okay. A little bit of damage. Should be able to pull that ripper down this turn. They got two helicopters left it looks like. Should be able to take them out. It's the uh, vehicle I'm worried about. That's a ferret. Okay. feel relatively comfortable about my, about my positioning right now. Whew. Worried about the evasion here with these guys, but I think we're probably going to be okay because we're not in direct line of sight of the turrets, which means they're in, into indirect fire, which means it's harder for them to hit us. I think this piranha, we, I don't know. I should have waited and re readjusted the weapons on it, I think. But we definitely do. I think maybe after this mission we jump systems. Ah, crap. I think after this mission we jump systems. Yeah. We're going to jump systems and then uh, we can get some uh, major adjustments done as we leave. We're going to lose money on this one. But hopefully we get some good salvage. Put us in a better position for missions like this. Shit. Alright, we're backing up. Back it up. Okay, let's back up to here. We are backing up this turn, so might as well back it up a little bit. Save a few LRMs on this one. Fire it. Copy that, Commander. All right, softened it a little bit. Good fire maneuver. We'll be overheating for sure. Looks like his weapons are gone. How are we doing here? 
Hmm. That's probably a guaranteed kill. It's got like no armor. But it's got no weapons either. Let's fire on this guy. Do that. Yes, Commander. Flames on the way. It won't matter where I go. I could push forward, but God, this is such a bad position here. I don't think we have a choice. We've got to back up. Let's take on this guy. Target acquired, locked in. Ah. That didn't hit. No, it didn't, man. I copy. Mm-hmm. I copy. Still a little bit unstable, but I think we'll be okay. Wow, only large laser, right? Eh? Whatever. <sighs> yeah. Yep. If we can get back up around the range of those turrets, I think we'll be okay. I think we've pretty much done that now. So that's the uh, the other um, Pegasus. He's got a different loadout than the first one. I'm kind of glad we took out that streak one early, earlier, I guess. I'm glad I took the uh, the bonus C bills at the start. Now we're definitely going to have to use those. I wonder what the inner sphere uh, play style is like if you if you don't take a lot of sea bills to start. I mean, I know it's probably cheaper in the mech category because the clan mechs cost a lot in uh, in um, upkeep, but it can't be. Th I mean, if we take into account that like, maybe they're like half the value, it'll save a couple hundred thousand probably per month. Yeah, you go right through those flames. Okay, I think we're out of the weeds when it comes... Is that the stinger? Yeah, we, we're missing the falcon. It's down there somewhere. We're out of the weeds, I think, when it comes to... Uh, um... Their LRMs. Okay, that should bring us just under. I'm going to take the chance and fire everything. Okay, not too bad. Oh, we got damage, but not a lot. Not a lot. We got a good initiative this turn, so that's good. We might be able to bring these guys down and hopefully finish this Pegasus up. I don't think we'll be able to do that, though. This guy's got a lot of armor. I mean, for this weight category, of course. Yes, Commander. Move order received. Now, my question is, how badly damaged is this guy? Uh, not enough to warrant shooting at him, I don't think. I'm gonna go this route. Save some ammo. 
Okay, one hit, not bad. Reporting. Let's get your ER large back here, buddy. Can we not get... Oh, we can, okay. Down, moving out. I know we're clumping up over here, but I think we're probably out of range of where to have to get hit by like a, an arrow or something. Okay, Helion, question now, do we keep you here? Commander. It's only 22% though. Confirmed. Let's make them choppers come to us. Alright, one hit, not bad. Yeah, we definitely need to get her some ERs for sure. Although, you know what? I think if we take the LRMs off the Kid Fox and we put those streaks on that we're getting, well, hopefully we can get out of this mission, we can put her back in the Kid Fox. And then we can adjust the Firefly to be a missile mech if it's got the hard points for it. Although I'm not convinced that it does. Either that or we... Uh, can we fit the Streak 6 on the uh, Jenner? Don't know. If we pull off one of the... We'd have to pull out jump jets, I think, to do that. I don't think that's probably a smart idea to do. Pull out the, the we could pull out the ER small, but I like having that in there just in case we run out of ammo for whatever reason. I mean, there's a high probability we could, especially on missions like this. I mean, we still got buildings and we still got turrets to go, right? I think we have enough lasers to handle that, but they've got long range weapons, so I don't know. Waiting for the choppers. So now that the Ripper's got no weapons, I wonder what it's going to do. Like, they should have put at least either a machine gun or an ER small or something on it. What they should do for those helicopters is put like an integrated quote-unquote chain gun, which would be like a heavy machine gun or something, that just dies with the helicopter. But it's just a, it's a, on all the helicopters, this is a common fit that's got, a, you know, X amount of ammo that can, can help. Or, you know, a, a, just a regular small laser or something. Ah, oh, thank you for partially moving up, guys. Can't wait to work with you. Can't wait to watch you get killed. Okay. What's our chance to hit here? Ooh, I'm liking the chances. Nicely done. Okay, Dallas. I'm receiving you. Can you get on this guy's side? You can. Confirm. Let's 
Is that going to be enough? I think we have to go with as much as we can here, which isn't much. Let's just go with the three lasers. All right, we penned. Nice. Maybe we can get Gundal in there to finish him up. That's a side shot. All right, use it all. You got it. Got a critical hit. Hover propulsion destroyed. Does that mean it can't move now? Well, it's almost dead. Awaiting orders. All right, finish him up, buddy. Thank you. That's a kill. That is a kill. All right, we got four left. I want to see if we can pull down these choppers before we get to the uh, mechs here. Reporting. Yep, use it all. Okay, we penned. Nice. We'll let Gundal take care of that uh, ferret. He's kind of close right now, but I mean, we'll pull him back. Should be able to handle it with the ER medium and the medium. Uh, all right. Excellent. No damage detected. Waiting for orders. And your ass is blind. Affirmative. All right, this should do it. Target locked. Or not. <sighs> should have at least got two hits there. Heard it beeping there. Oh, the energy's back. Interesting. Let's go this route. Fire and Adam. Wow. Gundal, you better kill this guy. Actually, I think we'll stick Goofy on him first. I wonder if that Ripper's got the, uh... Yeah, shoot.
Yes, Commander. Nice. A little late, but Reporting. Vehicle destroyed. it's done. GTFO, man. You got I'm here. Okay. Just one more for the rubbish bin. Copy that, Commander. Yes, Commander. That's the ER. What? All right, whatever. Reporting. Moving out. Okay, we got to cool off anyway. Sure, now all the dirty work's done. These guys are moving up, eh? Engaging jump jets. Oh, he's back here now. after the closest one obviously Confirmed. oh nice two hits this time stingers aren't notorious for their armor obviously so let's see if we can uh, do some damage on this guy If we're getting too close to those turrets or not. We gotta get rid of these guys. Oh yeah, nice shooting. Solid connection on that. Commander. Moving to position. Get that ER medium firing at him. And we'll get the tag on this guy too. Okay, let's go with, how many rounds do we have left? Yeah, we better make sure we kill him. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> the more we kill, the more they move forward. It's like, yay, we're winning. Well, I think we can move forward now. Oh, he's got a pulse laser. Damage minimal. Me wants. Commander? Get your asteroid over here. Ten four. Yeah, I put a little damage on him, not bad. Get him started. Finally, you're getting up here. Let's go, guys. Commander. Make 
sure we stay in the trees. Not the best chance to hit, but we'll take it. Now, we got a falcon part off the last mission. So if we can take this guy out by taking his legs, fingers crossed, we might be able to pick up a full falcon. All right, let's just dump this thing on him. Good to go. Confirmed. All right, laser hit anyway. I think we're out of turret range, which is great. So we should be able to sneak in and drop the turrets one at a time. I hope. Awaiting orders. Okay, uh... Let's just fire on him. I want to make sure we hit. We'll slowly strip the armor. Let's make sure we hit him. Yes, I think the more we mess around with this guy, the worse our position will be. There we go. Location confirmed. Now we'll switch these around. I want to save the LRMs for the turrets and stuff over there. Come on, you guys, keep moving. I copy. Mm hmm. Location confirmed. Let's get in the water so we can use everything on this guy. Okay. All right, not so bad. Not so bad. I'm receiving you. Got a side shot on him. Yeah, I'm firing. Okay, penned. Could go for a headshot, but... Ah, not bad, I guess. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. I'm not jumping. I want to try to get my stability back here. Last thing I need is to be knocked on my ass. Okay, more side shots. Just go that route. Ah, we have better chances to hit. My goal was to try and uh, take that leg with a lucky shot, but yes, come in. I'm there. Hopefully, we get a lucky shot. Nothing. 
Nothing. There's the leg, and the arm, that was a critical hit. and the torso. Oh. I'll make them dead. Well, at least these guys are finally showing up. Standing by. Come on, let's try for it. Taking the shot. All right, just don't hit a CT. So this is definitely um, more interesting, I gotta say. Unloading a full salvo. Shit. There's the left torso. That's a critical hit. It's more interesting to play this way, where you can pull the enemy away from the turrets and the buildings, like this. Engaging target. Okay. It's kind of nice because the turrets can't shoot me right now. I copy. Down to 15, down to 17. Oh god. What do we use, guys? Let's try it. Oh yeah, man, he bailed. Cool. Although, I don't, if he bails out, does that mean we get still get two parts? Probably, because both of his legs were intact. I hope. Oh, crap. Warning. Armor low. Yeah, they sensor locked me. Fifty-five ton turret chassis, eh? This guy was a heavy one down here, a hundred tonner. Uh, let's see my left side. Bad torso armor. Full Don't know if they'll be able to sensor lock me. They can't see me now because their mech is dead. Oh, I guess this means I'm still sensor locked. Confirmed. 
Problem is, we're going to have to get into direct fire with a lot of these things to take them out. As soon as they see me, they can just... Shit, they can see me still. Um, what? Waiting for orders. More than one turret's going to be able to see me if I move here. Yeah. 240 armor, 192. All right, I'm firing this guy. I'm reading heavy damage to an enemy structure. Bring it down. Waiting for order. So I guess that was over overspill, which is nice. Damage this guy. Oh, really? Only the four hit? Oh my god. Yes, Commander. Okay, two more hits. Nice. Oh, we don't got target on this guy, really? Go for the better chance to hit. Ah! Guess I'm a half a try harder. You are. Well, at least their support is trying to move up now, at this point. Oh, shit. Warning. Armor low. You think? Jesus. I didn't think it would be an ultra turret. Oh, man, that's a heavy loss. Really bad chances to hit, eh? Oh, both hit. Nice.
On my way. Double time. That'll just be a large laser hit. Roger. Full throttle. Geez, only 30%, huh? Well, at least we hit, though. Oh, yeah, now that we're taking damage, you guys ain't moving in? That guy's ATMs. Holy. Damage critical. Let me guess, streak LRM? Come on, you guys, get in there and do some fighting. Yeah, a pair of streak 15s. Wouldn't those be nice? Nice shooting, man. Definitely needed that. Huh. All right, let's go on this guy. Engaging target. Reporting. Move order received. Let's not get too close, shall we? Oh, look at the internal structure on that thing. That's fire in this building. Really? Well, these guys are finally getting close to where they can actually get into combat. Shit. Alright, at least he's not shooting at me. Okay, cool. At least he's hitting them. Yes, Commander. Have no doubt it will be done. The 
Okay, good solid hit. Gonna go after this guy. Because it'll be a waste of missiles on the other guy. Oh, of course. Oh, man. Let's try with just five. There we go. One down. Just need one more. BTFU, man. Back the fuck up. Ready for orders. Okay. I'm on it. Reporting. I guess we should just target the buildings now. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think Streak LRMs are overpowered? Because at least the sixes, you have to be in direct line of sight with somebody to be able to use them. Alright, fire on this building. Nicely done. Where's our LZ? Oh, of course! <laughs> right past the enemy! <laughs> <laughs> Where else would it be? Oh. Here you go. Take all the heat for us, buddy. Waiting for orders. Moving out. Oh, man. All right. What do we do? That turret's got to go. Oh, nice hits though. Whoa, we got the kill on it too. That changes things a little bit. Uh, you can't do too much. Now, I don't know if we're out of ATM range back here or not, but... Let's hope he can't see us. Firing. Negative damage. A light turret chat turry turret chassis. I don't know if we can get up here or not. Let's try it. I think if we can rush that turret, we might be able to pull it down relatively quickly. Don't die on me! I need a meat shield, buddy. Aye. Uh, 
I'm gonna waste those missiles on a low chance to hit like that. Not going anywhere if you don't hit him. Way we can attack one, not the other. They are pretty well. Helping each other there. Affirmative. Man, this episode is going really long. Well, it's helping a little bit. Okay, Firefly hasn't really been damaged yet, so it's not so bad. I want to know what's in this turret, though. This could be bad, it could be very bad. Okay, nice. We can get some lerms on this guy now. I'm just going to have you reserve. Get you over here. <sighs> she still has the best armor. All right. Are you kidding me? Girl, you have such good chances to hit. What happened? I'm receiving you. Moving out. Oh, man. Well, better chance to hit. I know I said I wasn't going to shoot unless we had a really good chance to hit, but we need to start applying damage to that guy fast. Aye, aye. All right, shooting for the Owens. That's good. Good news for us. That's not good news for us. I guess you're reserving. Well, at least the dart's offering himself up to die. All right, firing. Oh, God, really? Can 
we get up close and be out of direct fire range here? Don't think so. See what this Owens does. Affirmative. That should bring everything within range now. Optimal fire in range. Let's do this. That was a critical hit. Sure was. If I hadn't missed my streaks, that could have been a kill. Ooh, nice. Yes, Commander. Yes, Commander. Oh, well, that guy doesn't have a direct line of sight. We should be okay. And firing. Oh, nicely done. The missile should be able to finish this up with Dallas. Receiving. Or... Let's move. Engage. Well, tag it. A little late than never. Or better late than never, that is. We gotta take the tag off that guy, too. Alright, let's hope we finish him up. Nicely done. Good. Good, good, good. Target destroyed. My LRMs are out. Yeah, well. Ten four. At least he killed that guy. Oh, now the urban mech moves in, eh? Lovely. Ah, uh, you better reserve, eh? I should really reserve and see what, the, what our allies do here. Well, let's just see what happens. Hold on to nothing, huh? <sighs> if he gets lucky, though. Is there anywhere I can go where this guy can't shoot me? You think you'll go after the Owens though? Probably. But let's just do this. Oh man, I don't know what to do here. We could just try and get out of here, but I got I, we got to take that turret down. I think. Commander. Wait, your right, s sorry, left side is a bit better. Got it. Let's do that. Oh no, we got a target. Right there. Alright, we got a hit on it. I think we're better off going full speed. Get more chevrons. Yeah, you are not liking this mech. Engaging jump jets. All 
Uh, at least you're engaging the allies. Ah, oh, one hit. That's not bad. Get down here where you can't see me. Alright. We gotta do something. Nothing. Guys, go up to the turret. Where are you going? No, tur turret. I don't know. No damage detected. You gotta do something. Let's do some damage. Oh, for Christ's sake. Wait, so our left... All right, well, we can take a pot shot at him. Yeah. Wasn't expecting much. Yeah, it's all right. Nice. Commander. Okay, still right uh, side. Trying to figure this out here. Okay, right side. So we're going to go this way. Aye, aye. I know I'm running risks here, but I got to get this thing dead. Got to get this thing. Oh my god, really? Well, yeah. All right, well, let's get some damage, hopefully. girl all right still over a eh? all right turret systems destroyed what does that mean 
What does that mean? Where are you going? Get back into the fight! Okay, that could have been way worse. Where are these guys going? Feeling confident. We should be able to take this guy out. No damage detected. Damn it! I'm receiving you. All right. Nicely done. There it is, folks. All right, contract payment increased, but this isn't going to help. It's not going to help at all. Uh, we've got a boss, well, mostly armor damage. I don't think we took any really well, lower arm took damage, but that can be replaced easily enough. Lower leg fixed. We're okay on these guys. We lost the streak system though, so hopefully we can get that back. And a e clan ER small patchwork materials. That's going to hurt. SRM ammo we've got or streak SRM. Ooh, that's questionable. All right, let's see. ATM six. ER smalls to replace. Ugh, really? Um, regular mediums. Medium pulse magna. Two tons. Plus one accuracy. Ignore one evasion pip. So that's a good possibility. Rocket Pack 5. Streak 6. We definitely have to go that route. Oh, Streak LRM 15. Thumper Artillery. Really? Wait, what does this thing got? That's good to sell if you wanted to get stuff to sell, but we're not really interested in that. SLDF Cockpit. Now, can we put this in any mech? Huh. I don't know. I don't know. Clan double heat sink. Sensors SLDF royal double heat sink kit. Well, that's good for sea bills. Holy crap. So there is ATM, streak LRM ammo, streak SRM6 ammo. As much as it pains me to go this route, I think we don't have a choice. If you want to have good functioning max, I think we got to go this route. The Streak LRM 15 is going to be definitely, a, definitely, definitely, definitely a good use weapon. So let's go this route. We'll see what we get. Roll a dice, see. Case 2 would be nice, like, but whatever. Let's see what we get. All right, Falcon part, Stinger part. Okay, nice. ER small, so we replaced the one that we lost. We got the medium laser magna, just a regular one. Uh, a bunch of cores that we can sell, so that's kind of good. We got the uh, standard LCDF cockpit, which isn't that bad at all. And that's it, eh? ATM ammo. Um, wow, it's terrible. At least we get a bit of C bills for these cores, but not much. Yeah, not too bad, I guess. It could have been way worse. Could have been all medium lasers. All right. Uh, 20 days for repair. So we are going to be jumping systems. Not much we can do about that. And let's see here. Uh, I mean, the Jenner, let's manage the tasks a little better. Let's bring the Jenner right up. And Mongoose and then the rest of these guys. And we will be uh, re, um, 
allocating stuff to the mechs on the journey to the next planet. So we're going to go back, I think, to where we were. Um, not going to have a look at that now since this was a long episode. We'll go back to the planet that we were just on. Um, probably bounce back and forth between these two because they are roughly, you know, one skull, half skull planets. So we can get some half decent missions at our level. Um, I'll probably sell a bunch of GAC out of our uh, inventory. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave the episode there, guys, because it was a long one. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section below, down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.